nice having you all here today my old subscribers thank you and to those that are viewing for the first time or that have not subscribed please click on the subscribe button and the notification bell so you get notified each time we upload a new video and to my new subscribers thank you for subscribing please do not forget to hit on the like button yet another update with regards to actress Messi Ayegbe and her new husband Kazim Adjuti you know it's been off and on over her marriage to this particular man a lot of people have not been happy about the way this marriage happened even though he is a Muslim and he's entitled to more than one wife but you know there are situations where people will be like oh congratulations it's fine and there are situations where people will say no it's not acceptable and that is what is happening in the case of Mercy Ayegbe even though Mercy keeps portraying an impression like he is entitled to more than one wife so who cares whatever anybody wants to say they could go ahead and say that has been her reaction ever since people openly let openly told her that she is completely wrong even though if he is a muslim there are better ways of going about things today is a shocking information that Fusha Adioti, that is the first wife to kazim Adioti, is now revealing Fusha is actually slamming her husband and mercy ayegbe mercy has insisted that she was never friends with kazim's estranged wife and that she didn't break kazim's first marriage friends if you could recall that that was what mercy was responding to and trying to back up claims all right mercy and her current husband kazim adioti responded and said that she and her ex-husband larry gentry were never friends with kazim and his wife funsho adioti back then mercy made her relationship with movie marketer that kazim adioti public if you could recall that was in january 23rd 2022 and her ex-husband larry gentry who has already remarried took to his instagram a lot of us saw that where he showed a throwback photo of himself and mercy as a married couple posing with kazim adioti and his wife funsho adioti we could remember this particular picture that went viral and in that particular picture that her ex-husband larry had posted he added in the caption and said at last i thank god the truth is out this is just one of the many to god be the glory i don't need anyone's comment please however this led to the public to conclude that both couples were friends and that made people to even react more that mercy snatched a married man who is friends with her ex-husband but that did not end there mercy went ahead with her current husband to say that all that information that they were all lies kazim adioti and larry gentry were never friends that is what they are still saying they only met at kazim's 40th birthday party and that was like 10 years ago according to the information that was released and they can't kept on saying that why that picture was taken is that mercy was invited to kazim's birthday party alongside others in the yoruba movie industry that she now took larry along with her who was her husband as of that time and mercy was also never friends with kazim adioti's estranged wife that's funcho adioti mercy and larry simply posed in this picture that you can see there with kazim and funcho that same day that other guests were also taking pictures at the party with him being the celebrant of that party it's taking a different turn because people were even saying that it was after mercy and larry her ex-husband had gone their separate ways that was when mercy and kazim began their item years later but more information kept on coming up and they claim that kazim adioti and his wife funsho adioti have been separated for a while and mercy reportedly had no hand in the separation that is what someone was actually saying but with regards to what funsho adioti is saying so that was 
the information that came up earlier when Larry, her ex-husband, had posted those pictures. Mercy also said that Adekas is a Muslim and that he's entitled to many wives. She's still saying that up till date. And reacting to this, Fusha Asiwaju Adioti insisted that she and Mercy were friends, but the shame is that Mercy will not admit to it. Why would you be friends with someone? And then because of the way things have turned out, you're now denying your friendship. You can see that there are so many things with regards to this marriage. And that is why you see people are still very angry with Mercy. Fusha also claimed that she introduced Mercy to her husband, Adekaz, before Mercy took her husband from her. It's difficult for people to say it's not true. And you know, a lot of people are still finding it hard to say what Funshaw is saying is not true. A lot of people are accepting and saying she is being the truthful person and Mercy is the one that is lying about their relationship. And these were the exact words that Funshaw had posted out today. She said this, You were a constant friend of mine back then. I brought you close as a friend because I liked you, but you repaid me by sleeping with my husband, Kazim. These were the words that she captioned. And Fusha went ahead to say that Mercy's son was only five months old when Mercy started sleeping with her husband. And that Mercy's son is currently 11 years old right now. So you can see how long Mercy has been having an affair secretly with Kazim. However, Fusha still said that when Mercy was sleeping with her husband, she was married to her own ex-husband larry gentry it's not like she was divorced as of that time so why all of these dating activities coming from mercy there's no one that is even backing her up neither is anybody coming to counter what funshaw is saying and that is why a lot of people are letting mercy know that this her marriage is a no-no because even though she is claiming that Kazim is a Muslim and is entitled to so many wives. Yes, a lot of people know that if you're a Muslim, you're entitled to more than one wife. But not in this kind of situation, not under this circumstance. The way she married Kazim was so obvious that she snatched him away from Funshaw. That is what so many people have been posting on the internet ever since they both got married. Funshaw went further to say this. You were a problem in my marriage for years. So you can see that this thing didn't just start today. Neither did it just start yesterday. Fusha also accused her husband of lying that she's okay with him having a second wife. Friends, you can see this whole thing is not like the normal Muslim marriage that usually happens where the man is entitled to more than one wife. Obviously, Fusha has made it open to the public today that she was never okay with her husband getting married to Mercy Ayegwe. She had to respond and she said this again. Contrary to what Mr. Adioti said, I did not and will never settle to have a second wife in my marriage to him. So friends, we can see why Fusha is really upset. At first, she didn't want to say anything, but right now, she is expressing her pain you can see that this woman is in great pain how would you watch your husband taken away from you by someone whom you claim was your friend and that same person is now the one causing pain heartache for you in your own marital home it's really really sad why do some women feel comfortable and relaxed causing their fellow woman pain all in the name of, I don't care, he is entitled to more than one wife. You should care, even if he's entitled to more than one wife. You find out that in most cases, these men that have the right to marry more than one wife usually speak to their first wife and they let them know that, look, I'm getting married to the second wife. Because when these women are coming into the families of men that are entitled to more than one wife, they've prepared their minds knowing that, another woman will come into that home. You know, it's completely different from the case of Mercy and Funshaw. 
Fusha never expected her husband getting married the way he did. Fine, he's entitled to more than one wife, but there are ways to go about things. But her own case happened with pain and bitterness. Well, she also hinted divorcing Kazim as she referred to him as her soon-to-be ex-husband. She ended her message on her Instagram handle today by saying, I'm done. He's all yours. Enjoy. This is the final word she gave to Mercy. And you know, such word has powers, but you would not understand. That is what someone is saying to Mercy. For a woman to tell you, you should enjoy. Do you think it's really that word enjoy she's telling her? Well, as people have all posted on the Instagram page, on social media generally and saying they are waiting to see how it's going to end for Mercy. And they are even posting back the videos that Mercy has been posting, dancing and letting people know that it's none of their business that she is happily married. It's still so painful, sad and annoying when some women don't care about how their fellow women feel when they do things like this. So guys, let me read exactly from Funsho Adioti's Instagram handle. These were her exact words she posted. Let's get the record straight here. This post is regarding an interview recently going around by Media Room Hub with my soon-to-be ex-husband. In one of his numerous lies, I want you all to know that in contrary to what Mr. Adioti said, I did not and will never settle to have a second wife in my marriage to him. Kazim, you should stop painting a perfect picture of a marriage you clearly do not have with me. Oluwa Funsho Asiwaju Kocho. You and your side chick can continue with whatever it is you are doing, but never come out to social media degrading me or my children with your demeaning and childish attitude. I will not stoop to your level of rubbish and stupidity. As for you, Mercy, let's cut the crap. We were friends, but your shame and your glam lifestyle will not let you admit it. You have been sleeping with Kazim since your son was only five months old. I introduced you to Kazim as my friend. I called and personally invited you and your ex-husband to the 40th surprise birthday party I did for my soon-to-be ex-husband. You were a constant friend of mine back then. I brought you close as a friend because I liked you, but you repaid me by sleeping with my husband, Kazim. You were a problem in my marriage for years. Now I'm happy to let you know this is only the beginning of the end of you. I'm done. He's all yours. Enjoy. I'm really past this. Like I said in my first post, losing someone who does not respect or appreciate you is actually a gain, not a loss. Thank you all. So guys, this was the exact words that Funsho Adioti, that the first wife to Kazima Adioti, posted on her Instagram handle. She has just said it all. So friends, a lot of people have now come to terms with the fact that Mercy is the one lying about her friendship to Funsho Adioti, trying to paint a different picture entirely. And someone wrote this on social media. Well, I'm glad Mercy is now a Muslim too. Madame should drag them both to Sharia court so we can apply the Islamic punishment for adultery to Alaja Mercy and al Haji Kazim. Some Yoruba Muslims only remember they are Muslims when it's time for polygamy. I'm sure that Mercy doesn't even pray five times a day. There are different messages posted on Instagram on social media generally lashing back at kazim and mercy for their marriage guys from all indication funsho hadioti has come out to explain it all to the world we don't have anything else to say but 
all we say is, it's only a matter of time. Friends, what do you all think about this? Hearing directly from Funsho Adioti. Please, whatever you think, you could put that down at the comment section. Friends, nice having you all here today. Please, if you're out there and you are planning to get yourself involved with someone else's husband, disease from it. You may think you're enjoying now, but time shall tell. In the long run, you will come to understand that that is not enjoyment. You are just buying pain for yourself. It goes both ways. If you're a man too, you're planning on snatching someone else's wife or you're currently in a relationship with someone else's wife, you better run as fast as you can. Because the truth about life is whatever you do to someone, definitely it will come back to you in a different way that you don't even expect. That is how life happens. Friends, please, whatever you think about this issue right now with regards to Funsha coming out openly to let the whole world know about her and Mercy. Please, you could put that down at the comment section. Nice having you all here today. Please, before you step out, do not forget to do one thing. Subscribe and hit the notification bell. Also, like and share so you get notification each time we upload a new video. Thank you and God bless you all.